The orcs are in position, sir. They're prepared to charge the World Eater lines. Komisov Vladislav rubbed his temples and sighed. <sighs> Ready the basilisks and prepare to fire. Throne, providing orcs with fire support. Ugh, it sickens me to my core. Permission to speak freely, sir. The commissar ran his fingers down his face and made a noise of disgust. Yes, Sergeant, speak your mind. Quite frankly, sir, I'm glad it's the orcs that are charging headlong into that line of frothing chain-axe-wielding maniacs instead of us. The commissar nodded. We do not have the luxury of crushing the enemies of the Imperium with sheer weight of numbers. We have had to make compromises. Begin barrage! But... We shall take care to eliminate two birds with, well, however many stones it takes. Sir? Once the orcs break through the weakened line after our barrage and rout the heretics, we resume fire. We decimate the exposed orcs, make a charge of our own, break out of this encirclement, and rejoin the rest of the Steel Legion. Jam their communication, Sergeant. We don't need any heretic reinforcements. The Commissar watched the holographic display of the battlefield as it flickered with the impact of each shell. The relentless barrage continued for several minutes before Commissar Vladislav ordered it to cease. That should be enough for the Greenskins to break through. Vladislav watched as the green tides swarmed towards the heretic positions. They'd been champing at the bit to fight, and the Commissar couldn't deny their enthusiasm or tenacity. The traitor cultists that survived the barrage were quickly cut down. The traitor Astartes provided much more resistance. Their demon-cursed armor protected them from the worst of the bombardment, and the berserkers rose from the trenches, ready to furiously hack into the orcs. Vladislav watched as the orcs poured over the forces of chaos with only small pockets of resistance managing to hold out against the onslaught. But those pockets were being quickly crushed as mobs of blasphemous orc dreadnoughts that buzzed their way through the lines with wild flailing limbs. Commissar Vladislav picked up his vox caster and gave the order. Now, Captain, resume fire! Destroy the green skins! Vladislav waited for a response and heard only static. Captain, fire on the green skins! Acknowledge the order! More static. The commissar was about to send the sergeant out to deliver the message on foot when the Vox system crackled to life. Testing, testing, one, two, one, two, is this thing on? Vladislav's face hardened as he heard the voice of the orc warboss over the Vox system. Orc, you... Messed up your plans to snick us when we weren't looking? Yeah, well, I ain't that stupid. I knew you was gonna let us do all the work and then crump us right after. I ain't mad, cos <laughs> I woulda did the same thing. Zog, I did do the same thing. <laughs> your artillery gits didn't even see us coming. Thanks for the flashy boom, ducker, commissar. Let's see how you like hiding in holes from the big boosh. Now it's time for the fair fight. Warboss Blockhead out. Vladislav swore loudly and stormed out the command center, looking for the guardsman on watch so he could put a bolt round through his skull. <laughs>